Welcome to Zalonka episode 33, guys. Um, we've got a lot of harvesting to do today, so when I rolled forward into October, I rolled forward to 7am. Uh, as you can see, I've started this field, so I started 7am in game. Um, we've got a lot of parsnips that we have to harvest. October is the last month for uh, parsnips, and we hadn't, we hadn't even started those. We've done some carrot and and beetroot because we needed them for the preserves factory um, so we've got a lot we need to get done here um, obviously we don't want to be doing parsnips all the way through the episode uh, so we've we're also going to be doing some of our sunflowers if not all of them if we can squeeze that all into the day and then for November when we roll forward that'll leave us with some beetroot to do and some carrots uh, and then we'll be able to start subsoiling and doing tasks like that in November but uh, yeah that is the focus for the day I have already sent up this trailer once and the Zerion with the, the Flegel trailer hasn't come back but he's definitely gone up there so I'm wondering if he has when I put them on looping, which is progress from before, they never used to loop at all. Um, they now seem to sometimes drive off in a different direction on the way back. Um, before they never used to leave the, the destination. You know, they would empty and then they would stay there and they couldn't, couldn't leave. Uh, right, where is it? There, see? parked up, hit something they go down this road and there's no need to go down this main road it's quite irritating right so if I put it over here right and then do triangle we can get back to Back to doing one more end or end to end of parsnips because uh, we're on 59%. So this should get us at just oh, this telegraph pole is going to be in the wrong place. Get us to just over 80 80%. 80 am I going to get around? Yes, I am. Uh, as I was tabbing through, you probably saw I've moved the, the class harvester with the sunflower header into place so that we can break up the day with doing some sunflowers in a little while. Um, so I'm going to crack on with this field and I'll come back to you guys in a little while. Hey guys, we've just finished uh, field 51. Um, uh, so we're going to start field 53, it's right next door. Um, I've almost filled up the vegetable preserves factory. Uh, there's a capacity I think for about 36,000 litres. Maybe up there. We can look in a second when this trailer's full. Um, I'm tempted to just go and uh, start a new silo with this trailer and then go back up there towards the end of the day uh, and fill it up. Uh, I'm going to have to do some headlands along here in a second. Uh, put the old telegraph pole on the road. As you can see, the helper. doesn't want to go all the way there we go right 
how much have we got on the track? 100%. Oh, fantastic. Right. And that is 37,500. If we go here, 37. Actually, that will more or less fill it up, actually. So let's pull you out on the road. Um, and do create job deliver oh normally saves it right there we go start a job right so he's going to go off to the preserves factory um while we're here uh, i'm going to start on the sunflowers actually So I'm going to do this headland here where those pretty trees are uh, a couple of times over and then we can uh, break up the day a little bit by doing some sunflowers. And uh, this will feel weird because I've been doing four miles an hour <laughs> in the root, hut, root crop harvester and um, Now we'll go at nine miles an hour doing sunflowers. Right, is that enough? I'm going to do one more and I've got plenty of space to turn around. Yeah, look, definitely one more. Right. I'm probably going to go and do field 49 after this as well. Uh, I'll tell you why. Because those of you who have watched me before know I hate going on the crop. If we do 49, all of this will then be cleared for when we do the parsnips on field 48. So we'll be able to turn around on the ends without going over any crop. So I will probably do that do 56 then go up and do field 49 uh, and then we'll do field 88 last because that's also sunflowers I uh, hope that makes sense although I did buy field 74 so we'll have to do that as well at some point forgot about that but for now I'm going to crack on with this field and then I'll probably come back to you guys once we've, when we're doing field 49 oh See you in a bit. Uh, welcome back guys. We have filled up this trailer with parsnips and this trailer with parsnips. Um, we've obviously filled up the vegetable preserves factory or yeah, preserved vegetables factory. So I need a silo for uh, the parsnips. So we are... going to put in another straw bale silo for here right oh uh, do I want it that way around no I want it this way around there we are that'll do right let's Right, let's jump in here. Then we can empty these out. Uh, we could put more parsnips in the soup factory, but we know we're not going to use them up, so I'd rather put them in here. And then, as the preserve factory runs out, um, replenish there. Um, Right, once we've emptied these out, we are going to do uh, some sunflower harvesting in the, I want to say field 49. It's a big field. Alright, so let's put that there. Let's jump out. Then we'll clear that field so we can drive all over it to finish up the last parsnip field. 
Uh, this this looks clean. Uh, I noticed I needed a lot of maintenance, so just before I drove it around here, I gave it a clean and did some maintenance. Over eight thousand pounds worth on the tractor. Two thousand pounds worth on the trailer. Right. This one has a long animation. So, yeah, let's pop to the map while it does that. Yeah, so we're going to... You can see I've got the combine set up for field 49. Then we can do the parsnips on 48. Oh, come on, it takes forever. I know it's more realistic taking this long, but... Sometimes you do want just a little bit more gamification. Right, nearly there. Fantastic. Right, let's leave those there. Uh, unfold the harvester. Uh, turn on harvester and off we go. So I'm going to do a headland all the way around because you can see the edges are narrow with the track. Um, oh my goodness. Looking over in the distance, I uh, don't go straight. That's so embarrassing. Uh, we got almost one trailer of sunflower seeds out of is it field 56 the first one we did so I'm hoping we'll get two trailers worth out of here there's 22,500 litres on that trailer um, and we still have field is it 86 to go so we should have a lot of sunflower seeds to process after this um, it'll, I'm hoping it will keep the oil mill going for quite some time Right, so I'm going to crack on with this, I'll come back to you guys when we're finished. Hi guys, welcome back. We're just finishing off field 49. Um, we have not got as many sunflower seeds out of this field as we did field 56. Uh, not field 56, that's the big one. Is it field 54? Let's get our facts straight, let's finish this row and then check. Right. Yeah, field, yeah, field 56. Uh, it doesn't give me the size of the field. I was hoping for the field size. Okay. Yeah, so we got more sunflower seeds out of that field than we did this one. Right, turn off the head out, put out the auger. Right, there we go. So now all we have left to harvest from sunflowers is field 88. Right, so I think we should pop over there and start start on that straight away. Uh, um, there we go. Fantastic. So I'm going to crack on. I am liking having this class. I know I haven't got a class header and it looks a bit odd. But, um, yeah, something aesthetically pleasing about having a, uh, a nice class harvester. Um, yeah, I'm well chuffed. So I'm going to crack on, get this field done. I'll come back to you when it's finished so we can, uh, do the last field of, of parsnips. Speak to you in a little while. Hi right, guys, um, we're just finishing off field 88. I've just emptied the trailer for a second time in the oil mill. Um, so 
so the first time obviously we already had the, the seeds in from the other field for 49 uh, but what we've got here demonstrates that field 88 would have given us would have given us two whole trailer fours um, so now I'm pretty pretty much got the same amount of sunflower seeds in the awn wheel as I have canola so that should keep us going for quite a while um, so I'm happy there I, I don't think we're going to do sunflower seeds next year now I think we've got enough canola and sunflower oil between the seeds in the mill plus what's already in the potato processing plant um, we just need to think about what it is we are going to do next year now uh, oh where's he going he's missed a tiny little bit would you believe that Uh, is it going to get the last little bit no it's stopping right great news right so we're done I'm going to take this to the ore mill and then I'm going to go and start on field 49 in fact yes that's what I'm going to do um, I'll see you guys when we're working on field 49 uh, not 49 is it field 49? I'm getting all my number 48. Field 48 on the parsnips on field 48. Right, speak to me. Hey guys, welcome back. We are just finishing off uh, field 48. Um, it has taken quite a bit of time to get all of these parsnips harvested. Um, I think we can probably have a look at the end to see how much is in the silo. Uh, I hate to imagine. Uh, so we probably don't need to harvest that many next year. Probably just a small field or two. Um, so we're done there. You can see it's five to five in game. So it's pretty much the end of the day. You can see the long shadows. It's getting a bit, bit dull. So uh, once we've done this and we've checked, that's probably it for the day. Oh dear, I've got a bit close. Um, so we'll have a couple of beetroot fields to do and carrot fields in November as well as the last sunflower field which we just bought um, for, I want to call it field 74 right let's see how many parsnips we've got in the silo we've got 27,000 there in the trailer guessing over 300,000, 350 maybe 374 plus the 26, that's 400,000 litres of parsnips that is ridiculous um, yeah we won't be doing many parsnips next year that's for sure uh, so yeah, I'm going to go and put these in the silo, so we've got them to top up the vegetable preserves factory as that empties them out, um, empties out. But uh, that's it for this episode. Thank you very much for watching, and I will see you guys next time.